And this recording is obviously Kulumang with theorem number five. In the description box, Uzotola my links for other theorems and one record for this grade 11 Euclidean geometry series. So now we're interested to check it. Um, I recommend you go to Abugel and kill my theorems to get a better understanding of E Loganji Euclidean geometry. So theorem five is so discuss the proof and so prove out theorem five and then after proving theorem five basically pendulum questions just to show you to theorem five sim apply again again now theorem number five this is theorem number five with theorem number five and theorem number six we involve ama quadrilaterals as well as with ama cyclic quads cyclic quad ama cyclic quad d a Upilo C D. So A B C D it's a cycle it's a quadrilateral inside a circle. Leo quadrilateral C is good is cyclic quadrilateral. So theorem five and six we involve a cyclic quad. So theorem number five. We have this cyclic quadrilateral again. Okay. cyclic quad quad good theorem number five. C T the opposite angles of a cyclic quad are supplementary, meaning they add up to 180 degrees. Um, so the now we add another angle here, la, we total 180, this angle, now we slang this angle, you should get 180. So opposite angles in a cyclic quad are supplementary. This is a reason as seven side or whenever seven out theorem number five or performing our calculations using the theorem number five. Now, let's prove theorem number five. We are given the following points A, B, C, and D that lie on the circumference of a circle. A, B, C, D is a cyclic quadrilateral required to prove that law. Now, we have to law, the law, the law, the law, the law, the law, so this is what we are going to prove um lana gle gle recording here together now lana this is theorem number five cyclic quad dang it so now so now so prove now so prove this theorem five you need to do a construction just like amanyama theorems party this construction it's unique for theorem number five with theorem number five we do the following construction since i saw si tata u a simsanga ni seno bani no o and then si tata u o simsanga ni seno c you can also use ulo ganji u d umsanga ni seno o tata u o umsanga ni seno bani no p it just depends with the of no prove ama p ama angles so job and sang is a o no o c your prove all my angles lava i two t now is they are both equal to 180 degrees they are supplementary so by drawing by doing the construction lena you divide the angle yam at the center angle o which is a revolution into two and one into two and one so cnz and we are proving a much proving so we join uao and oc we join ao and oc o1 angle o1 is equal to two times angle d angle o1 is equal to two times this angle d angle o1 equal to two times angle d right so ct the reason angle at center equal to two times angle at say come ference at circumference so c7 so theorem number two to prove theorem number five la, right so in your cover need to o2 O2 is equal to 2 times U angle bani B. Same reason as above. Angle at center is equal to 2 times angle at circumference. Like it. 
So therefore, bega ke manje. Now we ngi tata u engel O1. Ngi mslanga ni seno engel O2. I should get to bani. I should get bo engel ban. Na mslanga ni seno O1, no O2. I should get u 360 degrees. Why? Mwaba ma engels at a point. Or a revolution. So mwaba ngu menshini le kale. Ngu na mslanga ni sa le line le O A, O C. But divide that is angle O by 360 degrees. So therefore, um, o, O1 is also equal to 2D plus O2 is also equal to 2B. So therefore, 362 angle D plus angle B in keep O2 as a common factor. Divide both sides by 2, 2. Angle D plus angle B is equal to 180 degrees. So, then prove it with two D now B to 180 degrees. By doing a construction this way, you can also do the same and show with the U A now C to 180. So, similar, similarly, now A no angle C, I should get Ubani 110. 80 degrees. So theorem number five is improving alentilali. There's also a converse for theorem number five, but the are you correlevant? Ngatin. Let me not say are you correlevant. I say ngatin as he say as he say when this is a cool thing that lagu do gan shuku. Go grade eleven as well as grade twelve. Is it? Let me be sure. Let me check something lah. So le now it's lang anisana le you should get 180 degrees. So yeah, ah man. Theorem 5 has a converse, but the ang need discuss it. Right? Ngova I I see I see seven siga cool my calculations with. Right. Theorem 5. Now my example sige. So theorem 5, Sienzani. When we calculate using a theorem 5, we use the reason opposite angles in cyclic quad of a cyclic quad so therefore if we no calculate to x no y lagu a so a 105 plus y i get 180 degrees why my opposite angles in cyclic lick quad in a cyclic quad so therefore y is equal to 180 minus 105 it's so 100 and keep 100 go okay y over equal to 75 degrees see we show see we show see we show 105 75 B, eh? Wait, 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 wait. X, baba. X, we are happy much. 83, it's 180 degrees. Again, you need to state the reason. Yeah, why would you X now? I'm saying it's on 83, I can get 180 degrees. You provide the reason, the opposite angles in cyclic quad are supplementary. So X is equal to. Uh, 180 minus 83 x is equal to uh, so 18 keep a 80 salad 3 so it's 97 a special a special a special minus 83 97 now answer it again now for b for b if no calculator x if no calculator y or z no one no x Alright. Check out try angle A B D. Yeah, but I can use the sum of angles in a triangle to calculate Y. La. So you to Y plus um, 40 plus 82 equal to 180 degrees. Sum of angles in triangle. So y is equal to 180 minus 
40 minus 82 y is equal to 180 180 minus 40 minus 82 equal to 58 degrees 58 degrees and then what's the next value in a calculator Marala? hmm hmm now we can apply theorem number five to calculate to x le na le now the second is that is going to be 180 so 82 that's 180 degrees uh, oh. <laughs> okay same reason as above la. opposite angles in a cyclic quad so x equal to 180 minus 82 x is equal to 180 8 in 80 so 100 in keep 2 it's 98 eh? 98 yeah 98 so 98 yeah you make sure you keep it calculate hey marawen 98 okay now i answer it here then for z um, now you calculate to z, you t z plus x plus 62, sum of angles in a triangle. Uh, so, CCT, z plus x plus 62 equal to 180 degrees. Anyway, I'm going to go back, but I prefer writing the sum of angles in triangle. So therefore z plus x body what's our value for x to 98 plus 62 equal to 180 z is equal to 180 minus 62 minus 98 z is equal to 180 minus 62 minus 98 equal to 20 degrees so this is our answer for theorem number five theorem number five i mean do, 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 do. question b final answer a to z equal to 20 degrees so theorem number five um brings us here let's see cc rapper corner in the description box check out my links for other theorems and y and z for this euclidean geometry series um, there's also an exercise on my years uh, just to practice on U theorem number five. So for now, I'll spawn on, on the next video. Like, share, and subscribe. Peace.